E.T. Final Score is brought to you by Ashley Furniture. are usually a big hit whether you serve them up in the morning or in the evening. I love them. Christine Gardner shows us how to create a healthier version of the breakfast tradition in tonight's Fresh Ideas. So September is whole grain month and if you saw last week's flavor section I kind of broke down all the different whole grains and what whole grain actually means. So today I'm making a whole grain pancake and it's something that's good for if you make it on the weekend you can freeze and toast it up for during the week and it's a breakfast that'll stay with you because it has lots of whole grains and a little bit of protein and I promise it'll taste good too. So I've got some whole grain pancake mix. Now if you can't find that, I will also have a way that you can make that up yourself. This is some quinoa flakes. Quinoa was another whole grain that I talked a lot about that's really good. And they make a flake version that still has the whole grain intact. This is a little wheat germ. And then I've got just a little bit of vanilla, cinnamon, and this is agave nectar, which is a sweetener that has a little bit less effect on your blood sugar. And then some low-fat buttermilk. And that's good and creamy, and that'll get, get some of the volume going in your pancake. And some egg whites. So let's get that whisked up and mixed really well. And then the last thing is some mashed blueberries. So I'm going to get these over to our griddle. It's still a little lumpy, but that's okay. And I've got about a third a cup scoop. So these make a good, nice sized pancake. And you want to get it on a really hot griddle and just watch for those bubbles to come up and that's when you're ready to turn them. Okay, so our pancakes are ready to come off. They're nice and fluffy and golden brown. The egg whites add a little fluff to the batter so that's why they puffed up a little bit and plus the added protein too. So this is a syrup that I made. I wouldn't probably use this every day, but on the weekends it's nice to indulge. Just a little maple syrup cooked down with some blueberries. And just drizzle that over. So there you have a healthy whole grain pancake that's delicious too. So you can find this recipe in Wednesday's Tyler Flavor section or on CBS19.tv. Pancakes are great any time of the day.